not be more thrilled. I'm having such a good time. I mean, it's the kind of thing that I guess you always fantasize about doing, you know? When I read the script and, uh, you know, and I obviously was familiar with the music um, and I knew Joe and I met Christian and all the rest, I thought it, I was in. I said, let's do it. It just took a little while for it all to get together. I'm uh, pretty blown away by uh, my co-stars. And this is a, an amazing character study set to music in one of the most brilliant scores by Rodgers and Hart. I play a woman named Gladys Bumps, and she's a showgirl in the club, in the sort of divey club where Joey comes to work in Chicago, and she and Joey have a little bit of a history, and it's not a very nice one. Vera is a great, great character. She's a woman of a, a certain age. It takes place in 1939. She's very independent. She's uh, married, but seems to have some sort of arrangement with this husband we never see. And uh, she meets uh, young Joey Evans, and um, they get together. And that's really what it's about. And she thinks that she can handle it. This is a character that um, would do anything to get ahead. He's a bit of a con man. He's a bit of a street hustler. He's a bit of an artist. He's a uh, hopeless romantic. But more than all of those uh, attributes, he was a, a guy who loved making people happy and loved entertaining. And he wanted to make it in a time in the country, the late 30s, the south side of Chicago, a time that uh, it was pretty dog eat dog. He's, uh, he's that bad boy. He's the bad boy, yeah. Richard Greenberg has um, managed to do an extraordinarily um, faithful and true adaptation while keeping it utterly modern. Um, he hasn't, he's actually restored a lot of O'Hara's original sort of grittiness and darkness and a lot of O'Hara's original sort of dark, wry, sexy humor. It's a very different kind of uh, a musical than and the musicals that evolved after Oklahoma. It, it's, um, it's rough, it's got edge to it. It's, in a way, it seems more contemporary than a lot of musicals that came after it. This was a very ahead of its time show when it first came out. And there, was, there were some major risque chances they took when they did it. So we're kind of bringing that stuff back. It's very sexy. It's about sex. It's about sex and desire and power and uh, money and, and all of those things that are, we got to, you know, deal with today. We get to bring to life this, this great show, Pal Joey, that is a bit of an icon and a bit of an enigma. And to be able to make it a reality is a, is a blessing. It's been great. I mean, I'm not, I know people always say that, but I actually do mean it. Every day has been extraordinary because it's, it's like, you know, you have the problem to be solved for the day. How do we make this scene work and this and that? And it's just, it's almost scary. It's been going so smoothly. I can't believe it's my first musical and I'm working with these people who are all at the top of their field. The sparks are flying. It's a good thing they have uh, fire extinguishers in this room because it's pretty hot.